What's up guys, Chaos Dark Soul here and today we are going to play some Pokemon Zeta. It's been a while since I've recorded. Last time we were here in Kivingtown we beat the Ghost Gym, but just barely. Just barely. And I, I think I'm going to go ahead and look at my team, see what I'm looking at. We got Magnitude level 32, who's going to evolve in four levels, I think, or two levels I think, I don't know, I forget, I think it's 34. To the 34 or 37. Jolly Nature with Faint Attack, Energy Ball, Jump Kick, Leech, Seed, Queen Dra, the Seedra, Twister, Agility, Bellwing, Brine, Fluffy, the Houndoom, Bite, Fire Fang, Howl, and Smog, Raptor, the Staravia, Aerial Ace, Endeavor, Quick Attack, and Wing Attack, Goro, the Mod Champ, Low Kick Strength, the Rock Slide, Brick Break, and Tantru, that's not part of the team. So if you are watching this video, make sure to hit that like button. All the support's really helpful. Uh, is this person going to be in my way? Can, have you seen Graham yet? Uh, okay. So you're just going to stand there? And No, you're not going to just stand there. But I don't think I need to go down this way anyways, so you're going to probably end up blocking my path. Okay, come on. And also, if you're not subscribed yet, subscribing would be very helpful. Hey, it's me, Jeremy. Remember the professor assistant? No, I don't remember. You've already gotten five badges. I actually didn't even know that. And if I beat him, I'll get the Surf HM, which obviously we need. And let me fix this webcam a bit. It's crooked to me. Hiker Jeremy has a grand ball. Oh, okay, now I remember him. He had a snubble before. Uh, so let's let's leech seed you, because I don't know if you're fairy yet or not. Like, I don't, well, I don't know if you're fairy in this game. Head, but does a lot. I don't like that. Well, let's let's go jump kick. We'll see. Super effective. So the scary face is fine. That would be Dr Pepper. Not sponsored, but still, it's a a very good drink. I recommend it. Magmar! Whoa, well, you're just not gonna. S oh! I want to know! Why did I go to no? Because I want Deerling to evolve, even though it's my highest level team member. That's why. Fire Spin, okay, that's. That's fine. Did a little more than I thought it would do for being. a crappy move. On a water type. Bubble Beam! Come on! Confuse Ray! Ah! Uh, okay, Queendra. Really need you to break through here for me. There we go. Bubble Beam. And hopefully, his next Pokemon isn't something that Queendra wants to handle. Queendra's getting up there. Nidorino! Okay, that's. You probably have poison. You know, I should know that Nidorino probably has poison point because Nidoking is one of my favorite Pokemon. It's not really useful in game unless you can get good TMs. And I should have known it was going to have double kick. That's fine. Firefang should get out. Yeah, Reno's down, Fluffy gets some experience, and Swablu. Eh, I'll stay in. Swablu's normal flying doesn't get to be dragon until it evolves. So we don't have to worry about any not very effective typings there. And I think that's his last Pokemon. Yep. What a, what a great battle. I can see why you won those badges. You're a fantastic battler. Here, take this. You deserve it. So obviously we need Surf to get to where we're going. I heard Team Asgard was over at Ladoga Town to the east of here. You should probably go investigate. I don't trust them. Anyways, I'll see you around. Okay, so we know who we're teaching Surf to. I can find where the TM bag is. There we go. 
because only one of my Pokemon's probably going to be able to learn Surf in the first place. Kingdra! We're going to get rid of Brine. Because Bolium does have the ability to lower speed. So it's obviously going to be a little bit more useful than Brine. And we're going to move Raptor up front, but I'm also going to go back to the Pokemon Center and heal. Because that would just be stupid not to. I always forget that if I hold the run button, I don't run. Well, maybe if I knew where the Pokemon Center was, I would go to the Pokemon Center. There it is! Hello and welcome to the Pokemon Center. We restore your prior Pokemon to full health. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? I'll take them for a few seconds. I... I don't know why I was giving Nurse Joy a voice there. I just felt like it. So let's start surfing. Of course it's a Lapras. Even though we're really on a Seedra. But I shouldn't be avoiding these trainers. I really should be battling them because I was not too prepared for the gym last time. Let's see him for Rain Dance. That's not going to be very helpful. And I really would like it if I just was not running into so many patches of land. <sighs> you saw me. Oh, how cute. Another trainer thinks he can get through to Ladoga Town. Well, I know I can get through. Swimmer Joshua has a Pelipper. It's times like this where I really just wish I had an electric type on my team. Yeah, Aerial Ace is probably the best move for me. Why are you defensive? And you need to protect. Well, Payback only does 10. Okay, that time it did 11. Water Pulse. Maybe he should have been doing that in the first place. Yeah, maybe he should have been doing that in the first place. Okay, let's go out to Goro. We have a super effective move against this thing. Roost. Well, we don't have a super effective move against him now! Please don't do a lot. Of course it does a lot. Critical hit. Kill. Oh, come on. Use strength. I figured he was going to use roost. I don't know why I decided to use strength. I mean, I guess that makes sense because strength would have been the only other move to not be not very effective. Gyarados. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Let's send out Magnitude. Even these trainers are being difficult. Level 35 Gyarados. We're going to use Leech Seed. Please don't have Ice Fang. Of course. As soon as I say it. As soon as I frickin' said it. I don't need to lose to some random trainer. She's bubble beam. Okay, you missed Ice Fang. That would have been nice against Magnitude. No bubble beam's not gonna do a lot. Kinda hoping I'd maybe get a speed drop. So Twister does. Okay, now you're gonna use Leer. I don't even know what... Okay, you have Twister as well. That does 20 damage to me and flinches me. That's wonderful. Let's not keep flinching. There we go. Bubble Beam. Can I get the speed drop? No. 
really need an electric type on my team. Slowly but surely, Gyarados went down. And you have another frickin' Gyarados. Okay, okay, this is fine. This is fine. Aqua Tail. That did a lot. Can I get a speed drop? Can you miss a move? Can Twister not kill me? Speed drop, please. Okay, there's Queendra going down. Didn't get any crucial speed drops. I don't want to lose. But I know you're just going to Aqua Tail me. There we go. There we go. Poison. Can I live in Aqua Tail? No. Critical hit, of course. Do you still lose damage to poison? No. Of course you don't lose damage to poison when you kill me. What do you do there? Bag. Do I have anything? I, I don't. Great. I don't need to lose. Okay, it's up to Goro, who has 16 HP. No, because using an Orenberry. Stop it, game. Just let me, let me attack with Rock Slide. Twister, don't kill. Rock Slide, kill. Poison, kill. Wow. That... That was a little brutal. Okay, I'm gonna pause because I don't want to waste all this time going back to heal in the video. So I'm gonna pause. And I'm back. It, it wasn't wasn't pretty trying to get back to Pokemon Center. Full Restore, that's nice. That'll be helpful. I ran into one wild battle. Level 25 Wingle. Figured I can run from a level 25 Wingle, can't I? No. Hit me with wing attack and I died. But I should be able to run from a level 25 Tentacool with, you know, my bird that has some speed to it. Ladoga Town. Please tell me you don't know how to battle. I don't think you do. So first thing we want to do is find the Pokemon Center. This area is blocked off by signs. Bicycle path under construction. Okay, that makes sense at least. You look shady. The kid you don't egg. Okay, well I'm going to go make space in my party by getting your sand shoe and hoping I don't need cut or rock smash. And I'm gonna get a suspicious egg. Probably just gonna be a Togepi. I'm gonna be disappointed if it ends up being a Togepi. But it might be something helpful. Move! Did I heal? Gotta heal to make sure I... Like, I can fly here whenever I'm able to fly. I don't even know if... I have fly, or if I missed fly, or something. I'm hoping I didn't miss fly. And then, obviously, Team Asgard's over there. So let's check out the egg. Looks like this egg will take a long time to hatch. How? Wonderful. And you know what I always forget? As I have a bike. I'm not sure. 
You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna pause the video again, and I'm gonna try to hatch this egg. Okay, I'm back, and I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna continue trying to hatch this egg. It's, it's gonna take too long, and I don't have that much time to record right now. Finally, brother. Our time, hold on. Finally, brother. Our time has come. The Vegas power hasn't stabilized yet, brother. Indeed. It's fortunate that Odin was able to predict its nest position so accurately. It is strange, though, brother. The boss said he needed two legendary Pokemon for his plan, though, brother. Is Devavius not enough, brother? I don't understand it either. Why would you need Jirachi, the victory Pokemon, when you have a piece of the living god? He's coming soon, brother. Are you ready, brother? Always, brother. Feast your eyes upon Team Asgard, your tr new true masters. Prepare yourself, brother. There's no stopping us now, brother. You, you're the kid that humiliated me back at the Pope Gahadron Collider, brother. I know it's Thor. They're alone now, Thor. Fear not. We can just throw a Master Ball and be done with it. They're not alone. Is that, is that Morgan? Damn it, brother. First Wilson, now Morgan. Are the only four taking a stand against Team Asgard? Never mind, we will show that we deserve to control a god. Okay, so I'm in a battle with a team, an Elite Four member, against Thor and Loki. And we have the worst possible Pokemon to be using right now. I'm not going to switch. Because I figured Elekid would go after Swana. So we have either a water or a fly. Okay, that's a Zorark. But it still says Sableye. Do you a water or flying? Oh, crap. I explained the stunt aerial ace on Elekid. Well, either a water or flying Elite Four member. We'll find out here, most likely. Float is also water. Night days, that's gonna do a lot to float. So, oh my god, is, this is gonna end up being a battle that I'm gonna have to win by myself. Aqua Jet, uh, please tell me that is a lot. Doesn't kill. Please don't kill me. Scary Face is fine. I mean, Float should be using Scary Face of all Pokemon. That thing is scary looking. After you get a level 30, that's what I wanted. Loki's gonna send out Baynet. Now I'm gonna switch. Let's send out Fluffy. Fluffy should be useful here. Baynet's a ghost type, so Bite should be wonderful. Let's see, what do you got for Luxray? I should have known. That Intimidate's not really nice. Okay, so Floatzel gets Thunder Waved by the Bayonet. I'm still going to use Bite on it. Aqua Jet does hardly anything. I guess the, um, the Intimidate did kind of hinder. So Morgan's got one more Pokemon. And it's a wall ring. Okay, that could actually prove somewhat useful. I'm hoping. Baynet, why did you have to live with such a sliver of health? Please, like, you Surf or something. I mean, Surf's probably not the best option for me if it hits our side too, but... Obviously I'm on Luxray. Paralysis is good. Confuse Ray. I'm my Machamp. Are you kidding me? Now Shadow Claw. Okay, bayonet has gone. Loki probably still has another Pokemon. Dragon. 
Sableye. Like the actual Sableye this time. Rock Slide 10x. Does not do anywhere near what I was hoping. Come on, Lorraine. I need you to live. I need you to actually help. The roar will be in the Sableye. This Rock Slide needs to connect. Nope, I hurt myself in confusion. Lux Ray is going to take out Warren. Great. You still live? Well, what? Do I have guts? Please don't. No, I don't have guts. I have no guard. So that's at least going to take out the Lux Ray. Sableye is not going down from that. I don't want to learn Vital Throw. And Thor still has another Pokemon left. A Sharpedo? Really? Great. Okay, send out Magnitude. I mean, this is, this is a wonderful two-on-one situation here. That's going to kill me. This is not a good battle. Now, I'm going to use Bubble Beam because when you try to attack two Pokemon at the same time with Surf, it does less damage. And I really wanted to get that Sableye out of the picture here. Okay, so now... Actually, Bubble Beam is probably still the better option. Of course you don't hit yourself in confusion. Why would you hit yourself in confusion when I need you to hit yourself in confusion? It did a lot more than I thought it would. Okay, so I'm down to Raptor. I don't have any revives. I have a full restore, but come on, it's a full restore against a freaking water Pokemon. Probably has Ice Fang. I need you to keep hitting yourself in confusion. I need you to hit yourself in confusion. Or miss your move. Of course not. This is probably going to be a longer video, too. Yeah, yeah, it's the second time I've had to see this already. Well, I guess next time... Well, in between next time, I'll train up a bit. I'll go fight those swimmers in the water, and we will take on the double battle once more. If you're still liking, if you're still watching this video and you have not yet, remember to hit that like button. Leave a comment if you know this game better than I do, which I don't know this game at all. Let me know if I can catch an electric Pokemon sometime soon. And I mean, share this video with your friends, anybody. I don't, I don't know. That's gonna be it for me today. Bye.